I think the whole the whole room, you know, is still continuing to improve in that, you know, in that matter. I think it's something that you build over time. It's not something that you can come in on Tuesday and just do it and it's over. It's because it's, it's a trust thing. You know, it's a trust thing. It's a comfort thing. It's a, do, can I listen to the guy when it's fast, when it's chaotic, when it's moving fast, excuse my language, but can I do it when it's hard? And you have to build trust on and off the field with the guys. So to answer your question, I think everyone's improving and Drake has a lot, but it's a moving process and we're still in the middle of it. Well, Kai's, is all, he's always been that for us. He's always been, even since I got here, he's been the utility knife in terms of being able to play any spot that we ask him to do, which is a, you know, valuable part of what he is. Kai's is one of the most improved, in my opinion, over the last year, year and a half or so since I've gotten here. Okay, he's, he's, he's always known what to do, but he's finally starting to take even more control of the situation out there. And then really more so for Kai's, it's as simple as you got to go take more shots. You got to take calculated risks and you're smart enough to know when those are. Don't make dumb decisions, but you got to take calculated risks. It's not enough to do my job. We got to get the ball carrier down, and we got to make big plays. You certainly, there's definitely a level of comfort there with Kai's. I mean, he's been doing this for a long time. He's had a lot of different coaches that have come through here. He's played a few different systems, so he's used to adjusting and processing information. Um, I would say Kai's is very confident out there. He's played a lot of football for us. We just got to continue doing what we're doing. I mean, we got to. I just told him out there, like, we weren't happy with practice. You know, two day, two practices ago, or last practice. So that then between that one and today, it's how do you handle adversity? Okay, and then after this one, we feel a little bit better about it. You know, it's never as good as you think when you go watch the tape. Now it's how do we handle success? You know, and those are two different ends of the spectrum. I know it's a success is a small, it's a, I'm talking about an hour and a half. I'm not saying we, did, we, did, we made it, but we had that small bit of success. Now how do we handle that going forward? We got to stay on the gas for those young guys. We got to eliminate any mental errors. Our offense has given us a lot of different things. That's part of having a new offensive coordinator is you're dealing with different issues. And we got to be able to handle that and solve it on the grass. And there's still situations out there where we're not lined up.